guys, so this is going to be a quick eye tutorial on this look here. It's just a smoky eye with a pop of copper sparkle in the middle of my eye. I love using copper pigment. I'm going to zoom in so you can see it. Because it just, I have green eyes and it makes them pop. So I like to use the color pop, uh, pop. I like to use the color copper. Here's what it looks like in the middle. And yeah, it's just smoky brown. So I hope you guys enjoy. Let me know if you have any questions. And thank you so much for watching. I'm going to start with the color Creme Brulee for Wet n Wild. It's just a perfect neutral color. And I'm going to place this underneath my eyebrow just to highlight and it also helps to blend everything out. Next I'm going to use the color Naked from the original Naked palette. It's just a neutral brown color, a little bit more on the warm spectrum. You could use any brown you have though. I'm just going to place it on a fluffy brush and just apply it really roughly into the crease just to define the crease. Also making sure just to bring it all the way into almost the inner corner here following that crease line. Just because the smoky eye is going to be dark color right across the lid from outer to inner. So I want there to be a smooth transition all the way across. Now taking this Maybelline color tattoo in the color Bad to the Bronze and just a cream concealer brush. You could use your finger, but I like using a brush with these products better. I'm going to place it just on the eyelid, right from almost the inner tear duct corner straight across to the other side. And I'm taking the product just up to the crease, stopping right before that crease color. Now I'm going to be using the color Buck from the Naked Palette. And I'm going to start placing that closest to my lash line first. And then kind of fan it up towards the crease. So right on top of where I put down that Maybelline color tattoo. But I want to concentrate the most color down here at my lash line. And then just gradually fan it upwards. Again, you could use any brown to do this. This is kind of a, I'd say a medium dark brown, but if you did it with an even darker brown, it would look a lot more nighttime and smoky. Uh, it's totally up to you. And again, as I'm fanning this upwards, I'm stopping just at the crease. I'm going to take a clean brush in a second, or you could use, even use the brush that you're using and just kind of make sure it all blends together with that crease color you initially put down. And back to a lighter color, Naked First, I'm going to use Buck right after, but I'm using a smaller tape, tapered type brush. And I'm going to take the lighter color, Naked First, and just drag it underneath my lower lash line. A little bit messily, just connecting to um, this kind of outer V here. And almost all the way into the inside. Then I'm just going to dab the tip of that brush there into the darker color, Buck. And I'm going to concentrate it more right at the lash line. So that it's darkest right where my lashes are and then kind of fades out a bit lighter. Now I'm going to highlight a bit using the color Virgin. This is not my favorite highlight color, but I wanted to kind of stick within the same palette. So I'm just going to place it right here on my inner tear duct corner. And I'm also going to place some just directly underneath my eyebrow. I'm not bringing it down, I'm just kind of following the line of my eyebrow. All right, now for that bronze sparkle I have right in the center of my lid, I'm going to use the Color Tattoo Pigment. This is the color, what color is this? Breaking Bronze. It's a loose powder pigment, so I'm just gonna tap a little bit into the cap, and I'm gonna use my finger to apply it just directly to the center of my eyelid. It's a really pretty copper color and it just adds so much light and sparkle to the lid and I love it. All right, now taking a black coal liner, this one is from Avon. I'm just going to tight line as well as line my lower water line and this just helps to frame the eyes. And lastly, I'm just gonna finish with some mascara. I'm using the Jordana Best Lash Extreme, but you can use any mascara. And if you really want to make this look um, kind of more dramatic, definitely use false eyelashes. Um, I'm not going to use them today because I'm not actually going anywhere. I'm just filming, so there's no need for me to have false eyelashes on. But if I were going out somewhere fancy, I would definitely add that to this look. All right, so here's the finished eyes. I'll try and show you from a bunch of different angles. But yeah, 
It's just like a smoky look with that pop of copper right in the middle, super sparkle. Um, I think it's really pretty, so definitely let me know what you think of this eye look down in the comment down below. And if you have any questions, please let me know. I think that's about it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!